Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Kayla. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. I'm sorry if you hear my chair like making noise. I need a new chair. Hi y'all, so today I am, well, the last video that I put up, it was a makeup video, I believe the Pinterest inspired rhinestone makeup look so if you haven't seen it already make sure you go watch it like comment and subscribe if you haven't already done so as well today I am going to be well it's not necessarily going to be a review but it, it will be like I'm just showing y'all the new pickups well the new shoes that I got um I also just want to mention one more time nowhere am I a like a sneakerhead that knows every single thing like when Jordan wore his first pair of Jordans and all that no I am not that I just like shoes I like I'm gonna buy what I want and that's pretty much it I'm not about to be out here buying every single shoe that comes out but anyway let's just hop right into it so the first pair of shoes I'm going I'm going to start out with is the Air Jordan 1's high OG biohacks um, Okay, so I seen these shoes on Farfetch. I actually, I was watching, I forgot his name, but he's a YouTuber. Um, he has like a whole bunch of subscribers or whatever, and he um, does shoe reviews, and he's like really into shoes. So I watched him, I think his name is Seth, Seth or something like that, I don't, I'm not sure. But um, I saw him on Farfetch, and then when I, I was like, oh, I never even heard of this. But um, Farfetch and Stadium Goods, they're basically um, combined that makes sense like um like they're partnered together so it's basically i want to say the same thing but like i said they're partnered together but anywho um yeah like i said i bought the original one biohacks and i bought another pair but i'm just gonna wait um, to talk about that but this is what the box look like and like I said, I did get them from Farfetch, but it still came with the Stadium Goods sticker. And in grade school, I wear a seven. So that's the size that I wear. When I was on Farfetch, um, Farfetch, I never even heard of Farfetch. Like um, when I was watching this video, that was the first time I heard about it. And then when I went on there, I seen more stuff that's actually on Farfetch. Um, like I think it's, I'm, I'm not too sure. I didn't look at everything else, but I know I seen Fendi. And <laughs> it's, it's just like a, a lot of um, other designer brands that's on Farfetch as well. So yeah, and they have a lot of sneakers. Yeah, they have a lot of sneakers on there as well. So if it's sold out at Stadium Goods, you could go to Farfetch. And then also, since I did get grade school, they were having a sale. So Okay, so these retail for $340.53, but with the sale, with the sale it came down to $291.93. When I saw them, when I first saw them and first unpackaged them, I was just like, oh my gosh, these are these are so cute. The the bright pink color really got really got me. Um, if you know me, I, I love colors. Like, I love bright colors. And then I love how it's, like, brown right here. So, it kind of, like, tones it down at the same time. But these are so freaking cute. Like, I cannot wait to wear these. So, yeah. But this is how I look. I love the green. If you don't know, my favorite color is green. But, yeah, I, I really love these. It's, like, silver right here. And you got the blue. It, it's just, like, every single color in, in the shoe just makes the shoe pop like i just love it so much and yeah and also what you will want to do you will want to inspect the shoe before you take this tag off um that's what it says on the paperwork that you will receive um i did inspect the shoes so everything looked good but i just didn't take them off because um, i'm not sure why i, I just didn't I, did, I just didn't get to that and as you can see they came with hot pink Coral, mm. yeah, I'm gonna say hot pink. Um, so they came with those color laces, 
mean, these are so cute. I feel like at this point, I said the UNC to Chicago ones were my favorite, but now I feel as though I don't even have a favorite anymore. Like as soon as I get the the lucky greens and the pine greens and it's it's the silver the black and silver shoes the, i mean yeah the black and silver air jordan ones once i get those i feel like all of them are going to be my favorite i don't have a favorite so these are so cute but anywho moving on to the next okay so these i've seen these um like i said you will get the text alerts to your phone if you sign up with nice nice kicks um you will get the text alerts when they are restocking and also my shoes are coming out so if you want to know when shoes are coming out i would suggest for you to go ahead and do that um these came out on nike as well they had like a an, another restock um i don't have any shoes like this so i was just like uh i might as well just go ahead and get them and i did i feel like i mentioned mentioned these in my last video I'm not too sure, but I feel like I did mention these in the last my glasses making them look different. But um these are so cute. I love how the red is like popping. But these are actually the the Air Jordan 1 Zoom Air CMFC sneakers. And I got them in eight and a half because I got them in women's. And then they come up with this um this little card stock or whatever. Just explaining the shoe and how the shoe is basically designed. And it also came with the shoe being wrapped like this. But I feel like these would be like so chill to wear. I don't know. I, I just I just like them. Especially the red bottom. So yeah y'all. This is what they look like. And they are so cute. Oh yeah, and I did get these from Hibbit City Gear never even heard about this website like at all i never heard about it and jd sports like they had them there first but then they were sold out so then i went to search them up all over again and then they had them so the resale price for these were where is it i don't see it yeah i don't see a price but it was like it, at first they were 140 something but then um they were having like some type of sale so they went down to like 120 around that price so yeah that's what they went down to if they were 140 it's like right there but i'm pretty sure y'all can't see that but yeah they were 140 and like i said i got them from pivot city gear and i do not think that they have these in stock anymore so yeah so yeah these didn't come out that long ago um i got them when they released the they weren't that much at all and i had my eyes on these anyway these are funny. but these are so cute i feel like so and then i have a jacket to match the shoes like i said i do have a jacket to match them um i did i can't even see that because i i got them and then i haven't really paid attention to them but i love the blue inside and it's like red in this one but that's like super cute and then it reminds me of like teddy like teddy bear and i was like oh yeah i gotta have these i've seen the fours that, that came out but i just wasn't really impressed uh, i don't know i feel like i bought too many fours anyway like i had the the lightning fours and the um oh, i always forget i always forget the names but i, I feel like i already bought too many so i was just like it's it's pointless i don't want to and then um i don't like too much winter stuff i guess i don't know i don't know but i was just like now nah, i'm gonna just go ahead and get these and these only and they weren't even that much they were only 85 dollars and they came with um no this is coral coral laces um i don't really think i'm going to be switching out the laces but I probably will because I feel like it's probably it's doing a little bit too much because it's like right there and then the shoelaces like they giving did I just say that? Did I just say it's giving? I am not that type of girl. So I really hope y'all like these because I do. 
So as usual, they came with the, the Jumpman logo. I always take these and I put these on my laptop. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Okay, y'all, so last but not least, I, <laughs> let me tell you something. These shoes came out, I don't even remember when they came out, but when they came out, I literally was thinking nobody was gonna be pressed for these shoes. I was like, oh yeah, I'm about to get these shoes. Like, I was on Kids Foot Locker. I was counting down the days and everything. Child, I went on there. Them shoes was gone. I was so mad. I was so mad because I wanted them so bad. And I was just thinking nobody's gonna want these because, okay, so I did get like information. Like, I'm more pressed and more interested in dunks. These, this is actually what the shoes are. So I did get the, wow, wow, that's crazy. I paid that price and these, these shoes retail for $90. That's crazy. But anywho, I did get the Nike Dunk Highs Grade School and I got the Syracuse. Is that the name? Yeah, Syracuse. I, would, I thought I was tripping for a second. Was the name not right here? But, um, yeah, I forgot what I was even saying. But I was just thinking that nobody was going to be pressed for these shoes and ended up not getting them. But I have been paying more attention to these shoes <clears throat> on the sneakers app. So, like I said, I have had luck with the sneakers app. If you haven't, I would suggest for you to try to um, stay on the sneakers app as much as possible. Like, don't just go in there and think that you're about to get some shoes. No. Um, well, that's well, that's. I feel like that's the conclusion that I came up with. Um, just go on the sneakers app. Yeah, sneakers app. Be on the sneakers app. Be active on the sneakers app, and then that's how you get the sneakers. So. I feel like that's the conclusion that I came up with. I'm not too sure if I'm right because um, the last shoes, which were the Bulldogs, Air Jordan 1s, I wanted, didn't get those, but I wasn't really pressed for them anyway. So, yeah. But, like I said, I was on the Snickers app, and then if you look, it tells the story of the Dunks. And, like, and before, like I said, um, I didn't think people were even, were even going to be pressed about these shoes because that was my first time seeing them. And then recently, well not recently, like a month ago, um, I was watching the story of the dunk and then a man, he was explaining how the dunks would like come and go. Like they would come and go, they'll be hot one moment, they'll, know, they'll stop being hot. And that's basically how, how it's been going for the, for the dunks. So my point was valid. I didn't really think people were gonna be pressed, but now, Dunks are a very favorite shoe. Is that a word? Favorite? Yeah. I just think I said it wrong. Right now, Dunks are literally my favorite shoe. Especially um, the laser orange Dunks that I got from the sneaker that They get these from Farfetch as well. Like I said, they were having a sale. Don't remember. I think it was like 20%. I don't even know. Okay, so these, these were... Uh, a little pretty penny and i wasn't gonna get them they the sale the the sales price they were trying to do 303 dollars and 74 cent but with the what's it called um the sale that they were having they went down to 260 dollars and 39 cent <sighs> when i tell you i love these shoes like i love these shoes do you see how bright it is and uh, i haven't taken the tag off either but i did already inspect the shoe i tried the shoes on um and tried them on to make sure they were my size but they are so cute i feel like i'm in love i really feel like i'm, I'm in love so as usual the tongue has a tag right here and it's like white and the inside is orange as well <clears throat> it has a nike logo But yeah, man, I, I really love these shoes. Um, I don't think I have anything else to say. But, oh, you know what? 
matter of fact, no, a little, um, I guess fun fact. Okay, so the, uh, my brain is like, I have the thought one moment and then the thought leaves me the next moment. But I do know that the dunks originated from the Air Jordan 1 and the 15, there, there's three types of shoes. There's three, th three types of shoes that the dunks originated from. One is the Legend, the Legend Air Jordan 1 and the Terminator, I think. I think I said that right, I'm not too sure. But that's where the Air Jordan 1 originated from and also they went by um, colleges for, this, for the shoe color. So that's where it originated from. So I really hope y'all like this video. Like I always say, <clears throat> make sure you get the text alerts and we'll do nice kicks and then also nice kicks they put out a um a, a post on instagram saying that the university red dunks were coming out i was looking for them and i did not see them at all i was mad about that because i was i was really waiting for them like i was checking on nike i was checking everywhere but i did not see them at all so i'm mad about that but it's not like there's no I can't get them off a of goat or wherever else. And also, um, pay attention to Nike too because they be dropping shoes and you don't even know that they dropping. They literally have some shoes coming out. I, I think I might buy them, I'm not too sure. But if I do, then I will most definitely go ahead and post a review as well. But thank y'all so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye y'all. Yeah.